Hey guys, it's Marky and welcome back to my channel and welcome to another episode sa ating Senior High School Subject Series na ginagawa ko dito sa aking channel na kung saan, sinishare ko sa inyo kung ano ba yung mga lessons or topic ang pinag-uusapan sa isang subject ng Senior High School. Para sa mga hindi pa nakakakilala sa akin, I am Marky Ermak and I am a Senior High School teacher and in this channel, gumagawa ako ng educational and motivational videos. Now, if this is the first video you're watching from my channel, I suggest mag-subscribe ka na para updated ka sa mga bago kong content. So for this video, pag-uusapan natin ang isa sa pinaka-importanting specialized subject ng STEM strand at yun ay ang Basic Calculus. Alright, this is STEM lessons for Basic Calculus. Now let us remember that Basic Calculus is one of the specialized subjects of the STEM strand in senior high school. So for the subject, ayun nga, basic calculus. At the end of the course, the students must know how to determine the limit of a function, differentiate, and integrate algebraic, exponential, logarithmic, and trigonometric functions in one variable, and to formulate and solve problems involving continuity, extreme values, related rates, population models, and areas of plane regions. So, yun yung ating overview for the basic calculus. Alright, so just like the other episodes of our series, mayroon pa rin tayong content and competency. Yung content ay yung lesson or topic na pag-uusapan sa basic calculus ng STEM. At yung ating competency naman ay yung kailangan yung achieve or yung objectives or yung mga kailangan yung gawin. First topic is we have limits and continuity. As a student, you have to illustrate the limit of a function using tables of values and the graph of the function. So you have to read in advance uh, how to do the limit of a function using tables of values. And of course, you have to be able to graph it. Next, you have to illustrate the limit loss. So if you're not familiar with limit loss, you have to read about that in advance. Makikita niyo yan sa ating screen. Uh, be sure to take a screenshot or read in advance the different limit laws na for sure magagamit ninyo sa inyong basic calculus. Next, you have to apply the limit laws in evaluating the limit of algebraic functions. It can be polynomial, rational, and radical. Next, you have to compute the limits of exponential, logarithmic, and trigonometric functions using tables of values and graphs of the function. Still in limit and continuity, we have to illustrate limits involving the expressions that nakikita nyo dyan sa inyong screen and using tables of value. So these are very important expressions that you have to be familiar with before enrolling in basic calculus for STEM. Next, you have to illustrate continuity of a function at a number and determine whether a function is continuous at a number or not. Next, you have to solve problems involving continuity of a function. Of course, hindi nawawala yung ating mga problem sets. And for this time, it involves continuity of a function. Maraming example ang nakikita natin sa Google. So be sure to practice solving that or those problems. Next, derivatives. You have to illustrate the tangent line to the, par to the graph of a function at a given point. I am sure you're already familiar with tangent line. But we have to take it to another level in basic calculus, so you have to do that. Next is to apply the definition of the derivative of a function at a given number. So as early as now, you have to read what is a derivative and be able to apply that definition of that derivative of a function at a given number. Next, you have to relate the derivative of a function to the slope of the tangent line. Next, you have to determine the relationship between differentiability and continuity of a function. Still in derivatives, you have to apply the differentiation rules in computing the derivative of an algebraic, exponential, logarithmic, trigonometric functions, and inverse trigonometric functions. So, marami kayong babasahin or marami kayong gagawin sa derivatives. Next, illustrate the extreme value theorem. So, if you're not familiar with the extreme value the theorem, Please look at the monitor and read in advance about that. Solve optimization problems that yield polynomial functions. You also have to illustrate the chain rule of differentiation. So there are lots of examples that we can see here on YouTube. So all you have to do is practice solving that one. 
uh, familiarize yourself with these um, terms and be able to pass basic calculus. Another topic is, of course, about integration. You have to illustrate an antiderivative of a function. Ano ba yung antiderivative? Compute the general antiderivative of polynomial, radical, exponential, and trigonometric functions. And of course, as a student, you have to compute the antiderivative of a function using substitution rule. So please read in advance about that. Ask your friends, ask your previous teachers about that for you to be able to be ready sa ating basic calculus. You have to solve problems involving anti-differentiation. Next, still under integration, you have to illustrate the definite integral as the limit of the Riemann sums. Illustrate the fundamental theorem of calculus. So, ano ba yung ating mga fundamental theorem of calculus? Kailangan yung basahin yan. Compute the definite integral of a function using the fundamental theorem of calculus. And of course, hindi natin mawawala yung ating mga problems na kailangan yung isolve involving areas of plane regions. For plane regions example, please look at the screen and be familiar with this topic. So that's it for basic calculus. If you're looking for other STEM lessons or STEM specialized subject na gusto niyong pag-aralan in advance, all you have to do is click the video na nakikita niyo sa inyong TV screen. If you learned from this video, don't forget to give this a like or a thumbs up, share this video to your friends, and subscribe to my channel for more episodes ng ating Senior High School Subject Series tulad nito. This has been your friends, Sir Marky. Maraming salamat sa panonood. Laban lang.